to talk about this so obviously I'm gonna continue using this but my acne is pretty much gone I have to deal with a bit of it and then just acne scars but basically um, about six days ago now I was browsing Walmart for some face masks you know as you do and I came across this for uh, like $11 and I was like it says rapid clear stubborn acne and it's a spot gel I was like Okay, and then this like silver writing down here, it says maximum strength, and I was like, boy, do I need that. So instead of getting any face masks, I decided I'll get this instead, and oh my god, it was like the best decision I have ever made. Like, I don't have a lot of money, and so some other things that I was using were just taking up all my money. Like, I would buy like these hundred dollar kits with like five or six different products in them and then I would run out then I have to like save up my money and then buy another one right like it was just so much and then I would constantly buy like all these different face masks I was constantly buying all these different products for years I mean I've probably spent like hundreds of dollars on trying to get rid of my acne and for eleven dollars this did it in like six days instead of six years so I'm pretty happy about this. Um, I am super glad that I found this. And obviously it didn't clear it all yet because it's only been six days. But I started noticing massive improvements by the third day. Like, it was insane. My face was red, puffy. It was so much everywhere. I started breaking out again. I had a whole bunch by my mouth. And I was so frustrated. I was like, why am I breaking out again? My diet is the same, my beauty routine is the same, everything I do is the same. Nothing is different, so why is it getting worse? So I was super glad that this worked because it's clearing up and that is a huge thing for me. I am so happy with how it looks right now. Like I could easily just quit and be fine with this, but I want to see how much this actually works. Will it get rid of it all? Or is this as much as it will get rid of? And so obviously I will have an update on this. Um, but yeah, I am super happy about this. Um, it works so well and I'm so glad that it works so well. Um, but yeah, no, I'm just super happy. Um, like some people didn't even like realize the change. And so I was like, oh no, 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 I've been taking photos of this. Like, look look at day one and they're like oh my god that is like a huge change and like so drastic too and it I don't know it was just so weird because not a lot of people noticed it but I really did because it was this thing where in the morning I would put this on before I went to school uh, and then I would wash my face and I put this on before I went to bed and I saw the change because I was actively doing it but obviously it's still a like it looks like I have a lot of acne because acne scars so next I just need to um get rid of some scarring and some active acne I think that's just gonna be a scar right there it's not gonna be fun um but yeah I'm just gonna have to like deal with a little bit of like active acne and then deal with getting rid of the acne scars and I will have clear skin for the first time since I was like 10 and that is gonna be amazing like I started getting acne about six seven years ago and it frustrates me it really does and I'd be lying if I said that I don't hate it like I don't hate my acne but it frustrates me sometimes because it's like always there and like I'm taking digital arts right now and our first unit was the photography unit and one, my uh, friend, she was taking photos of me 
And I was like, oh my god, like this high quality camera is making me look worse than I think I look. Like, I just like started like scrolling through like these photos we had to like hand in and I was like, oh my god, like it's so bad today. I started thinking, is this how it looks every day? Because I am obviously very blind. I need bifocals. I'm farsighted and nearsighted. Like, is it really worse than what I think it is? So just looking at those photos that she was taking of me in class, I was like, oh god, this is so bad. So, and then now it's like she's taking photos of me. Um, just doing, you know, like, what we need to do for class and everything, just, and they're not that bad, like, my acne is getting better, and I'm so happy that it is. I just cannot wait, and I'm gonna continue to use this until this bottle runs out. I think what I'm gonna do is leave this, um, kind of, like, six-day thing, and I'm gonna stop the video, I'm gonna, like, still constantly take pictures of my treatment, but I think I'm gonna do it my 30 day um, using the treatment. So probably about, let's see, how long ago was that? Because this was this week. So about two and a half weeks from now, I will have an update on how this is because I'm trying to do it. I'm going to do an update 30 days on in the treatment. I will have uploaded other videos than that, probably about like two or three, maybe even four if I figure out something to do for videos um, by the time I upload the treatment one. But yeah, so what I'm going to do is figure out how well this works in a month because this is just six days. Like, I'm on the sixth day right now. It is, what time is it? It is 3.17 in the afternoon and I started this on, so it's Saturday right now. I started this Sunday night probably around 10 at night. So it's been just under six full days. Like, it's almost my sixth full day and... I'm so happy that it's worked this much. I can't wait to continue to use this. Um, I can't wait to see how much my skin will clear up. I can't wait to see just it all being gone and only having to deal with the scarring. Because dealing with the scarring is actually fairly simple. Um, to get rid of acne scars, um, there's different things that you can do. Um, I think the easiest one is just exfoliating because you're getting rid of like the dead skin. And acne scars usually only go to like the first or second layer of the skin. And so if you exfoliate like about three times a week, no more than that, then acne scars shouldn't take too long to heal and kind of like go away. And there's like other things to get done like laser treatment. That's something I would probably never do in my entire life. That just sounds way too scary. Like I've seen procedures of it getting done. And I see that like they don't just go in for like one laser treatment. There are like these one there's like a girl who had like acne that was like a little bit worse than mine. She had to go in for I think it was 16 treatments. And I think that she had to pay for each one. So obviously it's not a one-time thing. And but this this is working and I just want my acne to be gone. I don't want any more active acne. I think right now all for I have for active acne. Um, this one just went away, so I think it's gonna may maybe be a scar. All I have for active acne is just this little bit here and a little bit on my neck. And that one's actually going down a lot more. And then I have one, I think, let's see, where is it? Maybe it's on the other side. And then I have like one by my, yeah, right there. This one actually went down a lot over the day. I mean, you could see it um, in the intro. There's like a giant one right there. It's literally gone, and I took that photo this morning, so... This literally got rid of that giant one that you guys saw by my eyebrow in the intro in less than a day. Because I put that on at like 9 in the morning and it's only 3 in the afternoon. So, I am really impressed with how this is working. Um, the only downfall is, so I didn't know this, like the first day of school of uh, using this, I get there and my friend was like, what's that on your face? Is there like makeup or something? And I was like, I haven't worn makeup in a couple of weeks, like what are you talking about? And he was like, oh, there's like a white smudge. And I was like, what? And I took, it took me a minute. I was like, oh. And that was when I realized that the stuff turns kind of white and flaky. And that is the only downfall of this. Like in some of my photos that you can see of me taking photos, you'll see like white streaks and stuff. And I think one of the reasons why that is, is because this is like a spot gel. And one of the things that I would do at night, and that's when I would mostly take these photos, is like at night at the end of the day. Um, in the mornings I would just put it like, like all my acne, 
but before I went to bed I would like put it like all over my face because I have a lot everywhere so it's just easier for me to apply it everywhere all over my face and then take my moisturizer after it dried a bit and put my moisturizer on top of that to kind of make it not as white and flaky um, but yeah so definitely one of like the major downfalls of this this is just there are white streaks it was flaky um, but it's definitely worth it like it's like it was like slight embarrassment to have like flaky looking skin when it was really just the spot gel and it was kind of embarrassing to have like a white line or streak on your face but I think that's more embarrassing to have like a full face of like bright red acne so I think that this is definitely worth anyone's time I mean it was $11 at Walmart it definitely works and I'm so happy that it works and I'm so impressed with just how much it's accomplished in six days I just I can't wait to continue to use this um, I can't wait to do it and then obviously to use this um, what you would do is you would wash your face as you would normally do that like you like I put on a face mask last night and then I wash the face mask off and then I put this on so like you just do like your normal skin routine right and then before you know like after you're like done washing your face and everything you put this on your acne so it's like a really simple easy thing to do like this is not like you need to do it every single day and it's going to take like 10 minutes to do or it's going to be like an hour waiting for your face to steam and then put on a face mask and then wait for that to dry and then you know it's, it's really simple easy you could do it if you have no time because I have no time in the mornings to do anything um, except put on my moisturizer my lip balm my shoes and run out the door like that's it and so for this to be so simple and easy um, basically all I would do is just take a little bit like that and I would just put it on my spots and I, I do put it on my scars because it's kind of hard to tell if they're just scarring or if it's active acne it's hard to tell so I just kind of put it wherever I know I get really bad like breakouts and stuff and I just kind of put it all over my face I probably should have washed my face before doing this but I didn't really do anything today so it's not gonna be a huge problem and anyway so I put it all over my face and I look like a complete idiot um, I like to put some on my forehead the forehead is probably like the area that I'm like most impressed with like I didn't have like a lot of acne up there but now I have like none except for like a few like small dots but the thing about those they're like skin tone like you don't even know you're there unless you get up really really close um, another area that I'm impressed with was like around my mouth and just overall getting rid of the redness that was a huge thing was just it's not red anymore and it's so much better it's not painful which was a major thing that really wanted me to get rid of it was it was painful I mean I would like brush my face a bit like moving my hair and I would like get it because I have really long nails and I would snag something or I would bump something or sleeping sometimes I roll over on my face or on my side and it was just so painful to have to deal with that and I don't think I've come across acne since I used this that has been painful or annoying um, my face is smooth and soft like even though I still have a fair bit of acne it's smoother than it was it used to be like really rough and bumpy and now I don't have to deal with that and I think that is amazing that I have literally just been spending like 30 seconds to a minute applying this every day and night and I just get a result that would have taken me years to accomplish with a more intense skin routine because I used to have like these really long routines where it was like you would steam your face then you would put on what was it it was I can't remember what it was but there was like seven steps you had to do like um, I remember like a couple of them which was you would steam your face you would condition your face then you would put on like this kind of it's not a moisturizer but it helped get rid of your acne and you put on like this green thing and I can't remember what it's called now but it would like neutralize the color of the redness and everything it would just get rid of like the red coloring then you would of course like use like a toner and you would use a conditioning for your face and there's like six seven steps involved in that and it took me nearly an hour every night to do that and the thing about like acne and treating acne is 
you don't just do one thing, call it a day. Like I know what I used to do was I would watch like seven YouTube videos at a time and then do all of those steps one night and then when I didn't get the results that I wanted, I moved on to like another like 10 or so videos. But the thing about your skin is that it really needs like a pattern, it needs a routine, it can't be changed up so often, it takes a while for your face to get used to things. And so one of the things that I realized was in order to actually get rid of your acne, find a skin routine that works for you and keep at it. Don't try to change anything, don't really add anything. Um, the things that I've added are very small, you know, moisturizer, okay, well, everyone should use moisturizer. Um, adding this, I mean, it's such a small thing to add and it doesn't really affect anything except get rid of your acne and it's just something so small and so basic. I think that even if you don't have a lot of acne, if you have like stubborn, stubborn pimples and stuff that pop up every once in a while and you want them gone as fast as possible, like within like a day or two, get this and if you don't have like severe acne, you won't need to use it all the time and this will last you a while. I've been using this for like six days all over my face twice a day and it's still like full. So I definitely think it's worth the $11. And again, like $11 is not that much. Uh, sometimes I would spend like $30 on one face mask because I would go to like Lush and I'd be like, oh, I need like this specific one to treat acne. And yes, they did work and yes, they were nice and yes, they made my face smell and look amazing but they didn't prevent or stop my acne. All it did was just make my skin feel and look brighter and that was it. So I found that sometimes it's easier just to find something cheap like this that works really well and I think that this does work really well. And I'm so glad that it does and I'm so happy with the results. I'm so glad that like people have like asked me like, are you wearing makeup? Like even my parents, like they, my, I went upstairs, we were having supper and I went upstairs and I was putting this on before I came back downstairs to eat because they were like, okay, well, uh, pizza will be ready in like five minutes. And I was like, okay, well, I have to put this on. So I went upstairs to put it on. My mom looks in and she's like, are you putting on makeup? Like your forehead is like clear. Like we're just eating supper. And I was like, I'm not putting on makeup. Like I'm putting this on because that's what I've been using. And she was like, you've just been using that and like no makeup. And I was like, no, I haven't worn makeup in a couple of weeks. I don't even really remember like the last time I put on a full face of makeup um, and that's because I just don't feel like I need to anymore. Like I know I've only been like using this for six weeks but, or six weeks, six days but over like the last few weeks I just haven't really felt like wearing a lot of makeup. It's just not something that I cared about enough. I was so busy with school and everything and then I started using this my acne started going away and people were like oh maybe you're just back to wearing makeup like no. I haven't um, put on a full face of makeup in weeks, um, but I do put on like lipstick. I'm wearing lipstick right now. I do my eyebrows, I'll conceal my dark circles and stuff like that. Um, but I don't know, I think that this is just such a great project product to invest in because it works so fast. It's effective. The only downside are those like little streaks that you see and it flakes a little bit like around your acne you could see that it kind of in some of my photos it's a lot more noticeable where there are like some flakes that's not dry skin I use moisturizer like two three times a day but that was just from this but I think that it's really worth that I think that it's worth having a couple of streaks on your face and some looks like dry patches like I think that it's so worth it I think that it's such a good product that everyone who has acne or struggles with acne or pimples should use it. And another great thing, this works on my cystic acne, which is a huge thing for me. Most of these acne products don't work on that stuff. It's always like, oh, it breaks down like the white heads or the certain ones that target black heads. And so it's so nice to have a product that's like, it works on all of it. It just cleared up my cystic acne. I have no more painful bumps anymore. Like it's amazing. Like I'm so glad. Like I had a really bad one on my neck right here and another one right here and I started using the stuff and it went down and I'm kind of have one like where is it um about here yeah it's like right there it was really red and at, and like really angry looking this morning if you saw it in my photo and it's just gone down and it was cystic acne and it's like gone within like a day and a half 
And then same with like, there was like some other really bad ones on my face, especially like around here and on my neck and everything. And yeah, so I'm just so impressed with this and it works on like different forms of acne, different types of acne. And I'm just so glad that it does. I'm so glad that I finally found something that I can use that's easy to put into my lifestyle. That's really simple, but it works and it's very effective. This did not take too long to get the results that I've been trying to get for months with other products. And I'm so, so glad that I bought this, that I tried this out. And I'm so glad that it didn't take long for the results to really show. And I just, now when I like go to school, like I don't kind of like walk in the hallway with my head down, you know, I kind of just like move my hair a lot more. I find that like I play with my hair a lot more and get it out of my face. Cause usually if my hair falls in front of my face like that, I just don't care. But I find myself uh, fixing my hair a lot more. I do this a lot more. I usually only ever do it to like this side when my hair is parted this way. But I started doing it to both sides. And that is something I have never done in my life. And it's just so weird. Because I just, I didn't even think about doing that. It was just like subconsciously just sitting in class and I did that. And I was like, that's different. <laughs> so I'm just so happy with how it's looking. And I just really want to continue to use this. And to get rid of my acne like I'm so ready just to not have to deal with this I'm just so ready to get out and have clear skin and not have to worry about what people think about me or worry about the pain of having certain types of acne because the cystic acne it hurt so much like it was so so painful there were times where like if I bumped it I would just start crying because it hurt so much and um you know I get it like I would have it like on my back or something I'd be sleeping and I would like scratch it on something because there's stuff like there's like papers and stuff and like binders on my bed from school because I do my work until I pass out and so like sometimes I would like bump something with like a sharp edge and it would just really make it worse and it was so so painful and I'm so glad that I don't have to deal with either the emotional pain or just the physical pain of having it and I'm so excited to move on to doing this for more than just six days. Like, I really want to know how will this turn out two weeks from now? How will this turn out after a month of treatment? How will this turn out even like a week from now? Just two weeks. If it's done this much in six days, not even like on the seventh day, how much will it have changed in 14 days? And that is going to be a major thing for me is just getting rid of this and dealing with it and just being able to do what everyone else does, being able to tie their hair back and not have to worry about what people think um, and just being able to do things that everyone else gets to do. I mean, I would love to do makeup and not have to like worry, oh, is this going to make me have more acne or oh, does this make my acne a bit more noticeable? Because there were things that I always stayed away from when I was doing my makeup. Like blush, I would never use that. I was like, oh wow, like I just spent probably like 20 minutes when I first started wearing makeup to get rid of all the redness. If I bring any of that back through blush, it's just going to be horrible. And so I would wander around being so freaking pale. It was so bad. I was like white as a ghost. And so... I'm just so excited to just move on with my life, get over this, and be able to really focus on more important things like graduating. I'm like, so like, it's probably like, it's like the first month of school and I'm already like, oh gosh, like in a few months time, I'll be like writing my, di my first diploma exam. I'm going to be like, I'm like really nervous about that. I'm like so excited. I'm like, oh my god, this class, like it's, this class is going so fast. I mean, it's been about a month now. We, we're already like on unit three and I am loving the class and everything, but oh my gosh, like it's so fast. It's making me realize that I don't have a lot of time in high school and I just don't want to have to deal with this after high school. And I'm so excited that I can like get rid of this and only have to focus on school and getting like a part-time job and doing all of this other stuff like I'm so excited to just move on from this 
and to just live my life how I always wanted to like live it. And I'm so, so excited to do that. I have so many ideas on like what I want to do a few months from now. Um, and just all the stuff that I just really want to do that if I continuously had like the amount of breakouts that I usually do, I would be too afraid to do really. Um, anything revolving around like photos and getting stuff like that freaks me out. So this school year when I got my photo ID, I was like, oh my god, this is like one of the best ones. Aside from my grade 9 photo, that was like my second or even like best school photo I've ever had in my life. It was like my grade 12 year photo. It's not trash. And I'm so happy for that. And I'm just so ready to just have a nice graduation photo too. Like I'm actually really excited about that. Even though there's still like nine months of school, I guess now, because we're still in September. Um, but on the plus side, it snowed and the first day of fall is tomorrow. But it's good because I am so excited to just, for, for just winter, I guess. I don't know. I'm like, I have like really cute like sweaters like this that I really like wearing and I love my jacket and I just want like the snow and everything. But one of the reasons why I always hated the winter was because my face would look 10 times redder than it was because I walked to school. But now I'm not even worried about that. Like I just like want to get out there. I want to walk to school. I want to, you know, like wear my nice winter boots. I want to wear my nice little jacket that I have because I love it so much. It's so, so cute. I wore it this morning. We went to like the farmer's market and we went to um, A&W and I got like a coffee from Timmy's. And I just like wore this cute like little, it's like a pink jacket and has like fur and stuff. And it's so cute. And I got it in July and it's not... It was $15. Like, we went to, like, Value Village because I wanted, um, well, I wanted some shoes, right? But I don't have, like, $50 to spend on shoes. So what I would do is I would buy, like, two or three pairs of heels because I have, like, so many. And I also wanted to get, like, a nice pair of sandals because we were going to go to, like, the um, Sylvan that day to, like, go to, like, the beach and everything. And I just really, really, really wanted to wear a nice pair of sandals. So we went there and... I was walking past like the cardigan aisle because I love cardigans and for $15 I saw this and I was like yeah I'm, I'm gonna buy that I need that so I'm in love with it it was super 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 cute and it's so comfortable and warm all day I was like walking around in the snow and I just it looked like winter outside but to me it didn't feel like winter because I was so comfortable and I'm just so glad that now that I'm like getting my acne sorted out, um, when I get like red face, when my face gets red from the cold, that people won't think, oh, it's acne. They'll be like, oh no, it's just because it's cold outside. And I'm like so ready for that change. And I'm just so excited to just move on and do so many things. And I feel like just using this more will really help me accomplish that. I mean, like, I'm already, like, super, super excited. I mean, if I felt like it, I would stop now. But I feel like, why not take this a step further? See how long I can go with this. See how much more it can do. And I'm just so, so excited about that. Other than that, um, I think my next video... Um, I don't know. I don't really have a whole lot of plans. Um, I might do, like, another makeup video. Um, but that might take a while. I'm doing, I'm still doing those renovations in my room. My new bed is coming on Wednesday and I'm super excited for that. It's going to be so great to have a bed that I will actually have like a functional room. Because I have like a fairly smallish room. But my bed was a queen so my room was like 99% bed and like 1% anything else. So... I just, for my last school year, I just really wanted to focus on graduating and my classes and everything. And so I just decided, you know what, now's the time to get rid of my oversized glorified bed and downgrade to like a double or something so I have more room for my computer desk and my chair and my bookshelf and anything else that I felt like I needed, which 
what I did need was this. A little station for my makeup with Marilyn Monroe little um, pictures, which I love them so much. They are so, so cute. I bought them about two months ago, maybe even like a month ago. I think they're so cute. And another thing that I love about this is my Nana gave me this mirror. And I think that it is like the cutest little thing, the cutest like little setup. It's a bit messy because uh, I've been really busy lately. So I've just been throwing things around. Um, but yeah, so most of the time it's organized and I'm still like going to figure out what I want to do with those posters and paintings that I have. Uh, that large one is actually my favorite painting and I'm going to hang it up above my new bed and I'm so ready just to move on with my life and focus on other things other than my acne. And I feel like I could finally start to do that and I'm super excited about that. I am so happy about that. I found myself taking more photos on Snapchat without using Snapchat filters, which is really weird. Like, I still use them because they're so cute. But now, like, when I send streaks in the morning, I just, I don't even care. Oh, yeah, it's flaking a little bit there. And a little bit there, so yeah. And then, like, a little bit of, like, a white streak along here. <laughs> but yeah, no, I don't, I'm just, I'm very confident now. And it's really weird because I have never in my life been so confident and I don't know about that. I don't know how I'm supposed to feel about that, but I feel really happy about that. And I just really want to wear my hair up more often now. I think this is actually really, really cute. I think I might do this tomorrow, maybe even on Monday, who knows. But I am super, super excited just to get this over with and just to end a almost seven year struggle. And yeah, so I will have another video probably next weekend because I do have a lot of stuff I need to do, like a lot of homework um, and a lot of other stuff I need to do. But I will be posting another video later and I hope you guys like this video and uh, subscribe as well because that would be great. Um, and obviously if you like my videos, I will obviously be posting more and continue to post these videos because I do love to make them. They're so much fun. Um, so yeah, just if you guys like my videos, um, subscribe and turn on the post notifications so you know every single time I post a new video. And that would just mean so much to me. And I hope you guys um, are just as excited as I am for the update to this video um, in a few weeks from now when it would be my 30 days using this product. And if you guys struggle with acne like me, definitely try this product out because it is so cheap, so effective, and I think that it is just so amazing. Anyway, I'm gonna end the video here. It is extremely long as per usual because I don't know how to shut up, um, but that's just me. Um, some of my videos will be a lot shorter than others. This one was kind of just my own personal review and how I feel about it. Um, my makeup videos are usually very long because I talk a lot to explain things, but I do have some like two minute videos and like eight minute videos and I will be posting like shorter videos as well later on. Um, but yeah, I'm going to end the video here and I will have another video uploaded next week.